Yo, what's up everyone? Today we're checking out another Game Tunes video. Tall Victor, sad origin story. I guess he doesn't want to be tall or something, man. I take it any day of the week, man. But let's check this out. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and let's go. No, wait, please. You don't have to do this. Oh, I don't want to be on plant food. Somebody help me. What the? Who's there? Who just saved me? Banban, -ban, how did you find me down here? What's going on? You are my little victim. Oh, broccoli man. What in the world is that thing? Go, go, go. There, you see that? That's the exit. Just a little bit further now. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Oh no, a dead end. Now what do we do? There's another way out. Quickly, follow me. If you say so. See that vent? Oh, it he is fast. We can crawl up through it to escape, all right? Not if those vines beat us there first, we can't. Then let's not let that happen. Come on. Almost there. Almost there. Go, go, go. That was too close for comfort. Looks like Tall Victor's grown even larger since the last time I saw him. Since last time you saw him? Ban Ban, you've gone down there before? You know that monster? I do know that monster. But back when I knew him, he wasn't so large. Or green. He was just an ordinary guy. Uh-uh. So he wasn't always a gigantic, terrifying broccoli man? Nope. Believe it or not, Victor used to be a world-renowned botanist. Best known for his study of plant cellular structures and how they could be used to improve human Bro, life. Plants, I would contend, are the single most formidable entities on our planet. They always find a way to grow back. Behold, a simple daisy. Now you may think this is just an ordinary flower, but That's because anything but ordinary once it's placed inside my brand new machine. My machine can take the daisy's cellular structure, dissect the parts to make it so formidable, and... allow others to grow back too. That's basically what Dr. Connors in uh, Spider-Man. His work was incredibly impressive. But sadly, not everyone saw the potential in Victor's innovative device. Sir, please, I beg you to reconsider. My studies are going to change the world. You just need to give me a little more time. Victor, no one here is denying that your studies are impressive. But what I said to you last time you came here still applies. Until you're able to test your device on a human subject, I'm afraid I can't give you full funding. But sir! I'm sorry, Victor. But sadly, I'm going to have to deny your request. Victor found himself at a crossroads. Without a willing human subject to test his device on, his conservatory would lose its funding. But using a device on a human before it's ready could be deadly. His leg's gonna grow back. Let's do this. He's gonna test it on himself, I see. What just happened? Did it did it work? How did yeah. the shoe grow My back? Leg. It's back! It worked! My device really worked! That's the stupidest thing oh, I've ever no. seen, man. What's happening? Ah! Dr. Connors. Oh, God. oh no! The lizard. What have I done? I'm a freak! I'll never get my funding back. The experiment was a failure. Victor had turned himself into a monster. After the failed experiment, Victor had nowhere to turn, so he took himself to the only place he had ever heard of that accepted monstrosities like himself. A place he wasn't even sure was actually real. Ban Ban's Kindergarten. Hello? Is... is anybody there? H hello Anybody here? Ah oh, man, what's the use? I can't believe I actually bought the rumors about this place. Now who am I supposed to turn to? <laughs> but eventually, somebody heard him. Hello? Are you okay? <gasps> Please, you you have to help me. <laughs> He's not gonna help me. I felt bad for him. He was lonely and scared, and he needed a place to stay. 
And that's kind of what Ban Ban's kindergarten's all about, right? So I helped him set up his lab in the underground warehouse, and worked as his assistant as he prepared to administer himself with his latest experiment. An antidote. But as Tall Victor worked tirelessly on a cure to his condition, his physique only got worse. His head's growing. Once again, Victor found himself at a terrible crossroads. His antidote wasn't ready yet, but who knew how much longer he could wait. So Victor decided he had to get a little creative. Victor hatched a plan to test the antidote on himself, prepared for the fact that it could all go horribly wrong once again. And you're sure you want to do this, Victor? I'm as sure as I'll ever be. Ready the laser. Well, here goes nothing. Huh? What's going on? Where am I? <gasps> Victor, it's you! The real you! You did it! I did? I did! I'm back to my normal self! Oh, this is outstanding! Thank you, I don't Ban -Ban. know about that. I could never have done this without you. Quick, now get me out of these restraints. Almost there. Just hold still and... There. You're all better, Victor. Your experiment is a success. You did it. No, Ban Ban. We did it. Uh-oh. Victor, what's happening to you? Are you okay? Oh no, it's... it's happening! It's happening again! And... there oh, it is. No, 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 no! Just hold on, Victor! The monster! Just hold on! Oh dear, he's gone even larger than before. What have we done? Ah! Come on, come on! Almost there! Ooh, that's lucky. So now what? Tall Victor's just trapped down there forever? That doesn't seem very fair. Well, sadly, I don't think he's gonna last much longer down there. That's why he's so angry. He desperately wants to find a way out into the sun. Because without sunlight, sooner or later he'll just wilt. That's terrible. Poor guy. Huh? Sunlight. Hey, bad, bad. So you can what come out now. Have? What if there was something we could do to help save Victor? What if we made him a skylight? A skylight, eh? And how, may I ask, would we do that? By using some of these! The funding? Whoa, now we're talking. I'm going to climb the wall to plant the charges. You get the remote ready, okay? I'm on it. Excellent. Operation Skylight is a go! Okay, now. Let's get you calibrated. What the? Why does it suddenly smell shit, so shit, good shit. in here? Almost like springtime. Uh-oh. Nab Nab, I think you might have a problem. He's and us. you're dead. Bad Man! Ah, my eyes! Oh boy! Jeez, Victor, did you really have to aim for my eyes? That is not cool. Hey, get back here! You want some of this? Okay, is that gonna stop him? I don't think so. I don't think get it's gonna you stop foul him. Beast. Get back! Wait a second now. This is the perfect spot! Gotcha! Holy mother of... Come on, Ben Ben! Hit the button! Hit the button! Come on. And boom. Skylight. <laughs> Did we do it? Did it work? <laughs> I don't know. It's too dark in here. Huh? Looks like you did it, Nab Nab. You saved Tall Victor. No, Ban Ban. We saved Tall Victor. We did it. Okay, that looks like the video. Tall Victor's sad origin story. Well, I think they helped. I think it, it's all a success, man. They helped him out. But he's not going to be a human anytime soon. But, yeah, man, that was a good video. I'm going to rate this a 7.8 out of 10. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.